Hi friends, this is AK Valia and today we are going to talk about Gmail settings 2022. So Gmail has included its settings uh, in this year and that settings help you to keep your Gmail account safe. In today's world where like the internet is growing at a super fast pace and everything's going digital, there's a lot of more scope uh, for sensitive information to be in your Gmail account. And you want to make sure that your settings in 2022 are updated uh, so that nobody can hack your Gmail account and you're safe. So to do that, uh, go on to your Gmail account uh, and click on the top right hand side logo on which your username is written and then click on manage your Google account. Since Gmail is operated by Google, uh, all the settings all the security settings are linked to your main google account so as soon as you come in here uh, you go onto the left hand tab where you hit the security and as soon as you hit the security you can see uh, the security page open of your gmail account and then you have some security tips that you can check up uh, so gmail will have a, have a host of recommendations for you which it thinks that you should do uh, to keep your account safe then the recent security activity uh, which will sort of show you uh, the number of logins that you have done into your gmail account and then it will also give you some information about the date that you did those logins on and the devices that you did those logins on uh, so you can all check that here and see if there's any malicious activity and then this is where you make your gmail account more secure in 2022 so here uh, on the top is the password uh, so you can see it it last changed on 12th march 2020 this is actually like a bad practice uh, because you should regularly keep changing your passwords uh, to make sure that if they are in accidentally in a, in a breach or if they are compromised you're changing them uh, frequently to make sure no one can access your account without your permission so uh, I'll change it after this video so you, if you want to change it just click on this click next and then here you have an option of changing your password uh, changing your password will also sign you out of any devices that you're logged on in Google uh, and then just make sure that you know of that then type in your new password and then confirm your new new password uh, choose a unique password it should ha ideally have the uh, numbers it should ideally, ideally have characters in lowercase and uppercase and then it should also have some special characters in them so this is the first security setting that you can change uh, to make your account more secure and then the second one is two-step verification. Uh, so two-step verification uh, is a way to protect your Gmail account, wherein if it's signed in from an unknown device, it will also ask for a prompt on another device that you own. So it see you can see that the verification is on since 22nd August 2022. And then this is the second step after you log in with your password. Uh, and Gmail account in a new device uh, then this is uh, the second thing that your Gmail account will do it will prompt you uh, on your Google account on your other devices which on which you're already signed in and as you can see my Google prompt device is my iPhone or what it can do um, if you don't want to use this method is it can verify by voice or text message and then you can see uh, that I have given like my number which is verified um, and then you can also add more steps if you don't feel comfortable with any of these uh, such as you can add backup codes so th this is a, a password that Google will provide um, that you can use and sign in from anywhere if you're app if you're traveling 
You can use the Google Authenticator app to get verification costs at no charge, or you can use a security key. So this is the two-step verification that you also need to turn on uh, to keep your Gmail account secure. Um, and these were the Gmail security settings that you can do uh, to make your account more secure. I would also recommend you to do this uh, so this is basically um, ways that Gmail can verify that it's really you who's trying to sign into the account. So uh, this is the recovery phone. So if G Gmail thinks there's something suspicious, so um, it'll text you uh, a secondary code on this phone. Um, or if the phone's not available, it'll, uh, it'll send you an email uh, on this particular ID that I've set up. So you're gonna recover your do account sometime. So you can use the recovery phone to set it up or the recovery email to set it up. So these are the basic two things. Signing into Google, just make sure password is changed frequently, to say verification is on. And then um, the ways we can verify you, just make sure that your recovery phone and recovery email are done and verified. App passwords is something that you may want to put on your different apps. So basically, like the apps that you want, uh, that you think sensitive data is present in them, just put a password on that and it will add as a third layer. Uh, even if someone manages to breach your account, um, they will also have to know the app password to sign in into a particular app. If you like the video, please share and subscribe. We'll be back with more interesting stuff. Adios.